so I had a question for you. Do you remember when it was last September? Love was changing the miles, tender, while chasing the clouds away. Oh, 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 2008 is the 21st night of September. This is not an act. Like, I really do get that excited on this date. I have for years because, you know, we've, we've talked about this. It's, it's, it's September 21st. I mean, there's a whole song by Earth, Wind, and Fire about this day. I spent 364 days a year waiting to be relevant on this day. You know, my love for that song doesn't need an explanation. It is self explained on this day so you know enjoy it is also nick's birthday today and uh that's another really fun thing um we spent the whole day just kind of well actually we didn't really spend that much time together uh why am i like we spent the whole day we he had to work but um we spent all morning together and we um slept in and we went to this great brunch on the upper west side uh cafe con leche this really cute Cuban bistro. And we had big old pink coladas. After that, we went to Cafe Lalo, which is a really cute, kind of like coffee and pastries place on um, 82nd Street. It was in that movie, You've Got Mail, which is one of my favorites. Uh, and I've been wanting to take Nick there for a really long time. Uh, so it was nice to, to take him there on his birthday. It was kind of like, like a little special thing I've been wanting to do for a while. He had to go to work after that, and I uh, had to go to a movie with myself, and I went to go see that movie, The Women. Uh, and I was so sad, saddened by what a disappointment it was. I'm not even gonna talk about it, just skip it. Don't even get the DVD, just, you know, it wasn't that good. And I really wanted it to be good, but it wasn't. So. Anyway, after that, uh, I went just kind of like wandering around on the Upper West Side and, and I sat at Starbucks for a little while and went to the park and just walked around. I took a lot of pictures. This stoop is my throne, this hood is my home, and the sky's always blue, but the brownstones. Me in Brooklyn, I ain't no Beverly Hills. So basically, we pay bills, then chill. East Coast bliss, West Coast diss. We do it like this, and we see it with a kiss. And a pound is just how it go down, it's the protocol. Do you feel me, y'all? Saturday afternoon, we talk about the night before, and tonight we're gonna do it some more. Sunday morning, hear the bands in the church play all day long. Every black is a new song Sitting on the stoop in bed style But we say hi when the brothers walk by Just pop an etiquette Sitting on the top step With a bag of chips to sit back Relax, enjoy the bricks We got a memory philosophy I don't mess with you if you don't mess with me It is what it is It ain't all hard up in the hood Sitting on the front stoop in the song Where's the mob beaters in cornrows Where the pants down low so the You know, it was, it was a great day and it's, it's a day that I like <laughs> because of that silly song and it's Nick's birthday and uh, tomorrow we are having uh, a party for him and I'm so excited to spend another birthday um, with him. You know, we had one last year and he hadn't moved to New York yet but um, I remember we had this big party for him and then the very next day he got on a um, plane to go to his sister's wedding in Sweden. and. Uh, now we're celebrating his birthday again, and the day after his birthday, he'll just be here with me. And it's just kind of, you know, it's, it's a nice little journey that we go on. And I'm excited to spend more birthdays uh, with him. So, yeah. So anyway, um, we've got his birthday party tomorrow. Looking forward to that. And another really cool thing, um, I was talking to my mom the other day. And uh, I was saying, oh, you know, Nick's birthday is coming up on uh, Sunday. And she was like, oh, how old is he going to be? And I was like, oh, he's 
turning 24, and she was like, <gasps> Christopher, you're robbing the cradle. Not, she actually didn't say robbing, she said rocking. My mom does that all the time. She like changes the phrase from the way it really is to like her version of it. And she also says float like a butterfly, sting like a bumblebee. And it's like, no, it's bee, sting like a bee. But it's, you know, it's your mom, so whatever. Um, and, and what was just nice about that conversation, we talked for a little bit about his birthday and what our plans were. And what's, what's nice is that she's slowly taking a bigger interest in him and, and him as a person and how he fits into my life. Because she did used to ask questions before, but they were very generic questions that she could be asking about my roommate or my friend, you know, like anybody in my life. But now she asks about him more like knowing he's somebody important to me. And so she wants to learn more. And you know, they're small steps, they're little, but they are steps. And uh, you know, after uh, my trip to Texas in, uh, well, a couple of months ago, I left thinking, it, the situation was just not ever going to improve. And it slowly is. Aside from, you know, being called Cradle uh, Rocker, um, Nick called me on his lunch break from work tonight and he was like, hey, guess what? I got a birthday message from your mom. And I was like, what? And she did, she sent him a text message um, to tell him I have a happy birthday and, you know, just, I just thought that was so cool. It just makes me so happy to hear that. And he responded. At first he didn't know who it was. And I'm glad he didn't write back like, who the hell is this? He figured out it was probably my mom. It was a, a Texas zip uh, area code. And so he responded and she wrote back and was like, you're so welcome. You know, uh, have a great time and take care of uh, my pride and joy. She's talking about me. She's saying that to him. And I just like that there was a brief dialogue, albeit over text messaging, but still, you know, that makes me really happy. So, so today is a good day. Today is a great day. And I'm gonna shut this video down now uh, because I have TV to watch and it's Nick's birthday and he's on his way home and, and I have little surprises planned. So uh, yeah, okay. New video, Nick's birthday and the 21st night of September.